seems like every game a new player steps up for the Quinnipiac Bobcats. Thursday night was no different. After yet another slow start, Quinnipiac closed out the game strong, ultimately defeating MacFo Niagara 61-45 behind Adele Thornton's career high 12 points plus quality play on the defensive end. Um, I mean, we were just working to outwork them. I mean, they outworked us at the beginning, so Coach really emphasized us like getting offensive rebounds working on defense to turn it into offense, and we just took it from there. Coming into Thursday's matchup with the Purple Eagles, Thornton only averaged 2.8 points per game. This was the first time Thornton has led the Bobcats in scoring, and only the third time she has reached double figures this season. Um, that's been our strength, that's been our MO for a number of years, um, and it was just so uh, rewarding to see Dell have a great night for us and really get us going and knocking down some shots especially the three that we needed uh, at, at right at the top of the cave to give us really some separation. So, again, it's it's nice to see um, that ball go in the net, and you can see that coming all week for her, and she's really been shooting the ball well. So um, it was great to see her have a career night in terms of that ball going in the net and really getting the ball to the floor for us. So Whether it has been Jen Fay leading the way with her presence in the post and on the wing, Morgan Manns with her perimeter game, Paula Stroutmanay with her unmatched grittiness, or others, Fabry appreciates the wealth of talent the Bobcats have, that anyone can be the leader on any given night. Yeah, that's really been a, a crucial ingredient to our consistent success, um, not only this year, last year, but really five, six years running. So um, it's, it's really, it, it's nice that, you know, for us, not only, not one person has to carry a burden night in and night out, but it's really, um, a benefit when other teams are preparing for us. And that next team to have to prepare for Fabry's squad is the Iona Gales, who Thornton and the Bobcats will take on Saturday afternoon. Brian Schwartz, Q30 Sports.